NVIDIA's new 12-pin power connector is real and will be coming with Ampere. So after being leaked by Chinese tech company FC PowerUp, it appears that NVIDIA's new 12-pin connector is real and is reportedly not associated with any industry group. This is just NVIDIA going rogue, creating a new power connector, and it's essentially two six-pin power connectors clipped together, eliminating the traditional gap between multiple connectors on a card. Why? What are you guys doing? Looking at the keying, it appears that in spite of this, traditional 6-pin connectors will require a 2x8-pin to 12-pin adapter and will not be directly compatible with the new layout despite having the same pinouts. It is, it is rumored there will be such an adapter included with the Founders Edition. Apparently, the reason for the new connector is because of a change in wire gauge, which means that the 12-pins could carry anywhere from 400 watts to as much as 600 watts of power, compared to the 300 watts that even twin 8-pin connectors are allowed to carry. Wow. Okay. Um, German tech blogger Igor's Lab posted a neat write-up showing how the thicker wire gauges can carry higher currents and mentions that this can do away with the pigtail 2 times 6 plus 2 pin cable altogether. Yeah, until such time as we're getting, you know, 800 watt GPUs and you need two so of these things. There's a, there's a comment on this um, that says, if you read the original article, which is in Chinese, um, the last sentence translates to, I fabricated all the content above. Sorry, where is this? Um, if you go on the tech power up article and you scroll down a little bit, there's yeah. a comment by uh, <laughs> a name that I'm not going to say, uh, that says, uh, the, the, the last line on the original article translates to, I fabricated all the content above. Huh? Well, I hope that's, uh, there's a few other statements that, or a few other comments that pointed out too. It's, it's not. It's not just this guy's. Okay, there's a reply to that that says that maybe means that he sketched the picture. That wouldn't be all the content, though. Oh, boy. Well, let's see how it goes. One thing I yeah. can say is real is the new 12-volt-only ATX standard that uh, Intel is working on. So Anantech oh, published what? an article about it a little while ago. Uh, they are doing away with the 24-pin connector. Yes, my friends. Um, so instead of having uh, 12 volt, which in a lot of cases is the only thing your computer power supply actually makes, and then there's conversions internally, DC to DC conversions from 12 volt to 5 volt and 3.3 volt. Instead of having your power supply do that, there'll just be a 12 volt harness from the power supply to the motherboard, and then your lower voltages will be handled from there. And there will actually be power connectors built onto the board for things like SATA power to come off of the motherboard. Interesting. So... I have a power supply and a motherboard. Really? I'm going to try it next week. Yeah. So I'll be making a video about that very soon. And that is huh. definitely real because I so have it. So you're going to need a different power supply for Intel or AMD. Um. Well, Intel, I think, would be pushing this as like an industry standard. I don't think it would be a closed standard. I, I sincerely doubt that. Okay. Hopefully, because that would be very annoying differentiation. Uh, wow, there are so many pages of discussion here in spite of the fact... Okay, maybe maybe this whole 12-pin connector is disproven. So, well, at any rate, um, bye.